Hey girlies, thanks for stopping by, checking me out. Let's get it, let's go. Hey family, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be doing a what's in my bag on my little camera bag. Do you guys remember, ooh, I don't know. Was it earlier part of this year or last year that I got this bag because of this strap is why I wanted it. And I went on and grabbed it. Now they're selling the straps by themselves, which somebody at Coach woke up. But for the purpose of the video, I'm going to disconnect this for now until I do the rest of my bag. Now I'm going to go ahead and get her unpacked because since I purchased her, I only used the strap. I never used the bag. And summer is coming towards an end. So I want to get all my summer bag wears in. So that's the plan. So if you want to see how I pack this little puppy, go ahead, girl, and stick around. I'll see you in a moment. Okay, thanks for hanging out. So we are all packed up. Let's take a look at what I did with the outside. I just attached a poodle that I had when I tell you years and years ago. This is a city trans find. And that's why it's cool to build up your accessories because if you're not extremely rough with them, they will be around forever. Look at that. Everything's still cute and dangly on there and everything. Okay, so that's that. And I put those on my zipper pulls. It makes it easier for me to open. And then I, um, here we go. Here's the inside, what the inside looks like. She is nice and packed. And you know she's not that large. So right on top, I chose to put my Kabuki brush. It is still hot in Georgia. So therefore, I like to keep the shine off my face. After I use my uh, beauty blotters, then I may want to... I don't know midday or towards the evening freshen up so there you go with the powder and then here we go right on the inside I pull this out I love how coach products are so interchangeable no matter what line they came from I fell in love with this uh, little tennis <laughs> racket wristlet when it came out I was like this is so cute in this specific style you know i probably wouldn't have wanted a whole bag but i definitely like this and then i have put this on here permanently so what i do is i order up a lot of these from she and so i don't have to take them off of each item especially if i really want it to stay on there i put those on the zipper pulls and in here i have my beauty blotters to keep the oil off of my face and that's by Mary Kay. They're kind of staple. Let me let you see how it's packed. You notice how everything is standing up. Um, that's just best. Some of the items, especially like my crazy glue, you don't want that laying down permanently. Here is my snacks, fruit snacks. They are my fave and they're so easy to carry with me. Here is my Visine. Keep those eyes clear. I chose to use my flat mirror from the Dollar Tree just because it just works out better when you're dealing with small bags and then here is my tiny little sample size lotion and here is my marketing tool i keep that with me all the time so sorry i did not know that my husband was going to start printing something while i was filming so i apologize about that printer guys and then back here i chose to just leave the card information in there. So let me go ahead and get this back in. Okay, there we go. Just like that, a little YouTube magic. Okay, and finishing up right in the back pocket here, I have my little composition book, just so that I'm able to jot some things down when I need to. These are so freaking convenient. You get it in a three pack at the Dollar Tree and they come in three different colors, so check that out. You know I wish they had pink. Here is my sleeve of gum. It has five sticks in there. And then back here, I have my tweezers so that if I ever have to pump fuel, I have not done that in so long, but, or you need to go to ATM machine, I could pull it out when I am rocking my long nails. And then here is my little lady pouch slash catch all, nice and glittery 
bold pink as well i love this <clears throat> in here i have these little soap sheets and then i have my feminine wipes in here as well as my wet ones so that's what i keep in there i could fit some more stuff in there i just have not opted to pack it out because that's just really what i need i'm gonna put the information tags back here in the back and then in the corner i had my water my little bottle of water i keep that with me so if i need i get a headache or whatever i can just take my pill and then Hi, on this side on this side i have my um debit card and then money so i did not opt to actually carry a wallet and then back here you could place anything flat or your um, phone just remember if you want to carry your phone back here you're going to want to make the inside less restrictive so that you are able to because uh, if it's too stiff it's not going to give and your phone's not going to fit just you know y'all know how that go this i'll let you see how i'm packing that bag this goes in the back pocket over here and then my gum, I keep it in that back pocket as well. This as well, so that I know exactly where it is to go to it and I don't have to unpack my bag when I want to utilize it. And also, um, you see how it created that gap? You could just take this, turn it upside down because that side is smaller and look how nice and flat it fits. And that's how I'm able to lay the kabuki brush right there, okay? and it, it will close right up let's put that in there put this in there i mean zip it on up there you go nice and tidy you can carry her like so by herself that's what i love about it you can add your uh gold crossbody strap a pink strap you can do so many things so many options once things are detachable so i try to stick to bags that have detachable straps i do not like permanent straps so here we are we're just going to connect this on and then we'll throw this around the body and we will be out of here. I have thrown this little keychain on here, which is my coach keychain with the little heart and everything. It's so cute. This, you can put your keys on or whatever. I just like it on here because I already have my key set up. So I don't need that for keys per se. And let's get this on. And then if you want to jazz the bag up, you can put some you know, you have the two sides here, one here, one here. You could put your little chain just to, you know, so it's not so plain. So if you guys want to hang out, I'll go ahead and throw something on there just for looks. I'm cool with it just being uh, plain like this. And I will just, you know, have my little poodle on the side hanging, hanging like that. That doesn't bother me. But if you're really into pom-poms and stuff like that, and you want something else on there um give me just a moment okay here you go this is what i chose to do since it's summertime i chose to use this strap here instead which is a skinny gold chain it just gives it a little elegant look in my opinion and then the white flowers these are actually keychains that can dangle on the side. I got tired of not being able to use them as charms. So what I did, I added an O-ring and I put it through here because I know it can't fit back through there. So I don't have to worry about it going anywhere. And I hooked the other side to here. So just get creative. And then I use my Inspire LV one on this side. And then I just threw on a pom-pom. So I think that's cute. This is, I'm not gonna do a full like multiple jazz up session. But I think that's a real cute look for the summer if you want it to, you know, utilize a lot of your items. I don't like having stuff that I can't use a lot. So I have to get really creative so that I can use. And you can use an even shorter strap to carry this as a shoulder bag as well. I have some shorter straps, but that is just, let me see. I thought I had one of the other ones over here to show you what this looked like before I put it on there. But you should be able to see. It was just hanging. 
and it doesn't have a connector here. So I put a O-ring here and I put it through there and that's allowing me to get this look. And I like this look. I think it's really cute. And then this I just hooked on the side for our pom-pom lovers. <laughs> All right, ladies, thank you for hanging out with me uh, with my bold pink uh, camera bag. Let me know what you think about this bag, what I did with it, what it fits and all that jazz. And uh, yeah, stay tuned for the next one. Make sure you like, comment and subscribe and please share this video with some of your other ladies in your life. I thank you guys for stopping by and you know, I always tell you, do as I do. Be better to yourself tomorrow than you were today. Y'all know it's never goodbye. I'll see you later. I know you heard that. Take a second look and you gonna replay all of that. What you here for? I guess we praise the Lord. Praise the body dropping any day. You paid the way for us. Body on the cross. He gave his soul.